Hey, what's going on everyone? Back here with the Adane mod 4.6 and we're playing the Biff Me 2 good campaign. Uh, there's a hotfix for it now, so hopefully it works. Sauron wages war with all little press. He must be stopped. Right, um... Save your game between missions with auto resolve. If your armies are not moving correctly, zoom in as far as possible. <sighs> okay. Lands of Middle Earth. This is a very interesting way of adding it. I don't know why they didn't just skirmish it like Age of the Ring did. Defend with Glorfindel. Um, how do I... Ah! Real time. Yeah, I was like, what the hell? How do I do this? Uh, yeah, so apparently, from what I understand, they're still using the plot system. Uh, probably not so much, uh, I don't know, yeah, I'm guessing Rivendell will have plots. Cool. Save that as the background. This is not the normal intro. Oh, it is. Cool beans. Uh, I'll do the evil campaign as well, even though I just covered it in Age of the Ring. And then after I do the campaigns for this, I will redo the good campaign in Age of the Ring because I didn't finish that. Whoa. What's this? Uh, bonus objectives? Oh, that's so cool! Alright, uh... Uh, alright. Uh, we'll go with healing. Any reason to play the good campaign again, or like, Biff Me 2 in general. Cause like, uh... <laughs> if the... I didn't mind the Biff Me 2 campaign. I love the Biff Me 1 campaign the most. I always will. I played it first, it was a part of my childhood. Uh, uh, to a knocking all enemies in their path. Alright, we'll do that. But yeah, you have to save between missions. Actually, go over there. Oh, what's this? Alright, we got level 3. Uh, I didn't know if the difficulties actually affect it, so I just played on medium. Uh, I don't, yeah, I guess, like, I could do a thing later, I might redo a mission on hard or something, like the last mission. Just, like, I don't know, bring a bit more fun to it. Alright, that'd be the gate. Wow, they've added, like, a fair bit. Like, more enemies to fight as well, which is really good. I like Adane. Like, I know their 4.6 update was a bit rocky because the campaign didn't work. Apparently it crashed as soon as you tried to play. Apparently you could play the good campaign, that works. But you couldn't play the uh, evil campaign at all. And hopefully, um, hopefully we have fun with it. I'll probably try and smash out this campaign, like, really quickly. Especially, uh, this mission that I just did in Age of the Ring. Like, I didn't expect 4.6 to come out so soon. Because they had only showed off, like, the first mission of the good campaign, so I thought, like, that's all they had completed at the time? So I was a bit, like... Yeah, frazzled. New objective. Bonus. There is no bonus objectives. I just feel- I always felt like the Biff Me 1 campaign was just far more interesting. Like, I love the way you, like, uh... Brought. Like, you built your armies over and you could name them. And, like, 
you had a lot of incentive to keep your army because you wanted to level it up. I've been thinking of actually doing the Biff Me One campaign again in the HD edition. Just as a like little throwback. Cause I do I I love the Biff Me Two uh Biff Me One campaign. Rise of the Witch King campaign wasn't as bad as I remembered, but um Yeah, like I played through that. Uh, some of the missions were kind of challenging, which was really cool. Which I like. I used to, like, try and always play on hard and absolutely go for it, but, like, with recording, playing on medium is just so much better. Especially because I talk. Like, I do commentary. And, like, my concentration levels of like multitasking is pretty terrible. I'm also, I'll apologize, I haven't uploaded to my other channel in over a week. I've just been solely focused on Edain at the moment. <clears throat> what the fuck? Okay, that, that was really strange. Okay. I don't know. I feel like they've tried to make this a bit harder. Alright, we'll get that. Um, oh, you actually have, like, quite a bit of buildings. That's cool. Like, that's really cool. It's too bad we can't, like... Uh, we can't, uh, yeah, like, but yeah. oh, we can't do the angles that the Dane normally offers, but, uh, yeah, I'll take that screenshot as a little teaser for my Patreons. I've been a bit slack with the Patreon bonuses. I essentially do all my thumbnail, I, I post all my thumbnails and stuff there. Um, oh, they're upgraded. Interesting. Uh, uh, okay. How do I do... Th How do I get Elven Supervision? Um, I don't know if I have one of those buildings around. Why not? At least Elven units are, like, bloody powerful. Wow, you get a thousand? No, I don't think the building to get all that. What are they doing? They're just standing there. Half trolls. I don't think half trolls are in a dang normally. Could be wrong about that though. Alright. Oh, cool. Level one. That did nothing. Ha uh ha. -huh. Well, it didn't do any damage. God, I feel like the heroes are really much weaker in their day. I like how they've got, like, the more classic. I don't like the Hobbit movies, but, like... I like when they use, uh... models and stuff from those. That's not Lorien Archers, that would be due to What? No? I've got a full army, what do you expect me to do? More are coming, so they've definitely tried to make it a little bit harder. Which is, like, a good thing if you ask me. Biff Me 2 campaign is a very easy campaign. Oh, I've lost down my reach level 2, I've already done that. 
Oh, crap. Alright. Send the heroes to take care of the beasts. Ah, uh, level 3. Yeah, I like how they've tried to make it a bit more harder, and... They've clearly, like, added things on, so they've got, like, stealth and stuff. I will be doing all the factions, except for maybe Imladris, because I dead set suck at Imladris. Yeah, that did nothing. I don't want to lose any of my heroes. Oh my god, they're still kicking. They're level 5, that makes absolutely sense. Oh, we don't even have Fortress. Alright, uh, let's go over here because that's where we go to next. We actually have ships. Oh. Ah, well, get off your horse. I'm not having you die from pikes. Arwen's always been a really weak hero. Except for the fact she... Okay, not on this. She normally gets flood. <laughs> it was one of her redeeming qualities, but like her health. Oh, and the Dane is three and a half thousand. In like normal bit for me too, it's like 1100. Alright, come on. Just run them over. Eagles. Yeah, I'm like super excited. To like play this campaign in a Dane. Like, it's actually something I didn't think was on the cards. Uh, <laughs> like, uh, okay. Alright, let's, uh, make him look a bit badass. Nah, heroes at the front. Uh, we'll bring that back. Whoa, we have... All the heroes. Okay, that bird's had an epileptic spasm. So, eagles, eagles miss out. Whoa! Oh my god, what is that? That is a big cave troll. Cave troll? Met Mordor troll? Alright, I don't know. Where are you? Cave troll. Okay. Alright, focus that. Do that. Ah, oh, thank god. Blade of Purity. I don't... Yeah, they have a base. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah, I'll probably try and do this, like, uh... Pretty quickly. My uploading's been a bit lax lately because... I, I was actually sick for a couple of days. Uh, yeah, a bit... Yeah, I was a bit sick. Uh, a bit under the weather. Also working and stuff like that. I'm actually looking for a second job at the moment. Because uh, I have a job where on, on weekends I teach the senior citizens on how to use phones or general uh, troubleshooting and stuff like that. Okay. See if this works this time. That was pathetic. Ah, there we go. Wow, that did fuck all. Ooh, what have we got to next? Summons a resting camp. Nearby enemy units, heroes, monsters gain no experience and gold for killing their enemies. Okay. You don't get them off the bat? That's kind of annoying. But they have made this level, like, much harder. Well, not much harder, but there's definitely more enemies to kill, which is kind of cool. Do they have a time limit? No. You may as well put you on aggressive. Oh. They use powers. 
That's something you don't normally see in campaigns. But if you want me to do... Or if you want me to replay... The, uh... Shadow and Flame campaigns in 1.1... 1 .1. Oh no! My birdie! Oh no, you're like aggressive, mate. Oh, you glows! Yeah, get shit on. Alright, uh, I want you to attack them. Arwen, please don't die. Oh yeah, she has a heal. So they've changed some of the powers, which is kind of interesting. And I'm not going to judge and answer questions like which is which version's better at a 1.09 version 2 Age of the Ring and a Dane. I always believe they're good in their own right. Not a massive fan of um. I just realised they would have had to like add these assets in. <laughs> Cause uh, they only recently got a goblin faction. Uh, Miss Mouse, you should check that out. I did a video on it uh, on the Miss Mouse faction. I did miss out on um, one of the fortresses had plot points, and you couldn't really see him from a certain angle, which was my bad. Jesus, my oh god! At least he went out with the bang. Oh my god. Anyone got powers that are useful? Oh my god. Cave trolls. Alright, you run away. Take them out. Oh, at least I built some pikemen. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Oh, go off and down the Oh my god. Oh my god. Can we revive our heroes? Because... Alright, we need to actually... Build more, damn, like... Can't we get archers? That would be handy. We can't actually revive my people. Oh, hello. I'll probably record most of this in one sitting. Because, uh, yeah. I've got to really get in the mode of uploading more regularly. I, I generally get, like, three to five videos out per week. And... Once I start working two jobs, that's definitely going to have to change. Uh, like, one of the jobs I was looking at is actually night shift. So, yeah, I'm going to become a nocturnal per I was like, I'm already nocturnal, so why the fuck not? Uh, come on. Yeah, level 5 cave trolls. All level 5 units. Like, we might actually get a decent challenge out of this campaign, maybe. If that's, if that's the case, like, if the difficulty actually affects it, I don't know. Okay, I thought a key command might work. But, uh... There we go. Come on. Alright, that's one cave troll down. That's two down. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I really wanted to do the Age of the Ring version first, but, um... Because I've been going back and actually redoing a few things I've already done, because I'm, like, a lot better now, a lot more confident. Uh... I do... I definitely... What the f Okay. It's still popping out units from somewhere. Okay, half of you go deal with them. No, you deal with them. Gorfindel did breach level two. Oh, I've. Oh my god. Like. My god, really? Really? I wish I had a stables. They're archers. Oh no, they're not. Wow, they actually. They actually know, like, to use, uh, stances. It's rare for AI. Fuck the worm. Oh my god. I don't have the eagles, they died. Yeah, this is this is gonna take a minute. <laughs> like is there really nowhere I can, um, get, like, wow, they actually took that? Okay. Half these buildings I cannot select. Alright, they're nearly dead. Yeah, use the eagles. Get eagles killed. That's always smart. Fire is bad. Kill that fucking worm. These are dick shit. Oh, thank God. I believe I got all my heroes killed. That's up first. And it said, save in between games. 26 minutes. I think that's the longest this mission has ever taken me. Uh, <laughs> Alright, that's a really good thing. I like what they've done. But, uh, yeah, we better, um, keep recording. Got my V, as per usual. Alright. Resume. I really hope I don't lose my heroes. War, war of the, actually no. Give me two good campaign YouTube. <clears throat> all right thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you're all having a good time and staying safe out there i'll see you soon goodbye for now welcome to the end of the video shout out to my lovely patrons you keep the stream alive even a dollar per month it's a lot of help and it goes a really long way and thank you all for essentially getting me to this point we've recently passed 500 subscribers woo and yeah this is so i'm making a new outro so we have a few discord servers here we would like to show off um this is my private patreon discord server if you're a patreon you get access to this depending on your level but um 
even one dollar a month you get that access to most stuff just like uh we've got videos youtube playlists behind the scenes which i just like generally drop stuff all the time like nice behind the scenes stuff and we've got our main server here and um once again links to pretty much everything co-owned with nadaline so we've got news wall mod content other game content pretty much a bit of everything for everyone and don't and forget to go look at my social media i'm very active on all of them there should be some screenshots popping up but yeah go check them out thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed the video goodbye for now hey i just thought i would add to my outro and say i now have a biff me english community set up um and i thought i'd show it off because i've been linking in the description but yeah so we've got like biff me mod news uh content promotion of like youtubers that play biff me general game news and yeah we're still just getting sort of used to everything uh and yeah check the links below and you'll see it All right thank you